If you're still using Windows 10, here's some important news. Starting October 14th, Microsoft will no longer support Microsoft 365 apps on Windows 10. But what does this mean for you? Let's break it down. In a recent announcement, Microsoft confirmed that to keep using apps like Word, Excel, and Teams seamlessly, you'll need to upgrade to Windows 11 before October 14. This date also marks the official end of support for Windows 10. Here's the catch. Upgrading to Windows 11 isn't as simple as hitting update. Windows 11 has stricter hardware requirements and millions of older PCs simply don't qualify. In fact, you might need to buy a whole new machine to make the switch. Microsoft's chief marketing officer, Youssef Mehdi, called 2025 the year of the Windows 11 PC refresh. He emphasized the need for modern pop hardware backed protection to stay secure in today's digital landscape. But the reality is, transitioning everyone to Windows 11 by October seems nearly impossible. As of December 2024, there were nearly twice as many PCs running Windows 10 compared to Windows 11. Here's some good news. If you're not ready to upgrade, your Microsoft 365 apps won't just stop working after October 14th. But without updates, you might run into performance issues and security risks over time. To ease the transition, Microsoft is offering extended security updates for the first time to consumers. For $30, you can keep your Windows 10 PC secure for another year while you decide on your next move. Businesses can extend security for up to three years. Still, Microsoft's message is clear. The clock is ticking. Whether you need to replace aging hardware or upgrade to Windows 11 for its modern features, now is the time to act. What's your plan? Upgrading to Windows 11 or holding on to Windows 10 a bit longer? Share your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech updates. Thanks for watching. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side.